What's up, everyone? Welcome to Power Play with CJ. Uh, last night, I headed over to the Garden to watch the uh, Boston Bruins take on the Minnesota Wild. And uh, fan slash friend of the show, Charlie Coyles, uh, home co homecoming, second game against the Bruins, I believe. Second game in Boston, I should say. Um, you know, Wild got the big win. Charlie had, a, had himself a solid game, which was, you know, you got to take a go with the bat as a Bruins fan. So, you know, anytime Charlie plays well, you got to be happy. And the Bruins are continuing to play like, you know, a pile of. Well, garbage fire, but that's a different story entirely, as their blue line is in absolute shambles with the Krug injury. Um, but subplot of last night's game. Uh, first time seeing Jason Zucker play in person since he played for the U.S. development team back in uh, 2009. And uh, it was good to see Zuko, you know, get out there, and I think he had himself an assist. Him and Charlie run, were on a line with Miko Koivu, so definitely good to see. Good to see him, you know, attack with speed through the neutral zone and all that, but if you saw the picture I tweeted, it was down below by the bench before warm up, during warm ups. You know, I had the shirt, just kind of hook Zucker up with the shirt, and never came to push. He didn't even look at me. It's kind of disheartening. Then when he's coming up the ice, I, you know, did like, I acted like a four year old kid, had my hand out, hit my hand really, really hard. Which was like, what are you doing, bro? It's, I'm not trying to get in the ring with Tyson over here. I mean, you know, I could have broken a bone or, you know, broken a nail. Which was a bad joke, but you know, the, the Zucks become like the Melanie Collins of this year. Remember when it took a, it took me like a year to get Melanie Collins to finally wear a shirt? It's like that with with Zuck, and I, I, hey, it can't make me not like him. You know, I, I think he's a hell of a hockey player, and you know, pretty cool to see a kid from Vegas make it to the show. But you know, he needs the shirt. You know, really complete being awesome. You know, the being awesome cycle, and I think um, you know having him rock a power play with CJ Minnesota Wild style shirt that I my T-shirt guy, meaning me, designed. Um, you know, would be would be pretty cool, and you know, Charlie has one. You know, and I'm, I'm sure other guys in the Wild locker room do, but aren't open about it. And that's cool. You know, as long as you, you know what style is, I think that's a um, you know that, that's a positive. So, Zuck, what's it gonna take? I can make a donation to a charity in your name for me and send you a shirt. I'll I'll do whatever. I'm a man of the people, and uh, you know the people include Las Vegas natives playing in the NHL. So, um, definitely got to get that shirt out to him. And he, he said he'd wear one. Just saying you'll wear one and actually wearing one are two different things. It's it's like the the John F. Kennedy speech: "Ask not what your country can do for you, but what you can do for the, your country." Somehow or another, it's relevant here. I just thought about throwing a JFK quote in there because I don't know. Anyway, that's like this episode of the Power Play with CJ on. Um, the continued pursuit of Jason Zucker to wear a power play with CJ shirt. Stay tuned for episodes throughout the season and beyond. Later, guys.